eclipses are short, right? The shortest eclipse could be a few seconds long. The longest eclipse that you can ever have is something like seven and a half minutes. The slowest that the eclipse is moving is about 1500 to 1600 miles per hour over the ground more than double the speed of sound. If you want to keep up with the eclipse, you have to have a supersonic airplane. In 1973, uh, scientists flew a, the prototype of the Concorde and they were able to like cut holes in the fuselage and set telescopes to look through it to look at the sun. And because the Concorde flew supersonic, they were able to keep up with the eclipse over North Africa for 74 minutes of totality. Now, the downside is you're flying supersonic. That means you have this giant shock wave around your aircraft and looking through a shock wave means the atmosphere is doing this and it's really, it compromises the science, unfortunately.